channel. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. I haven't filmed in like a month. I've been really busy with classes, I'm so sorry. But I have a surprise for you guys. If you didn't already tell by the title. I finally got the Nintendo Switch and I'm so happy. I'm so excited to see it, to play with it, to do everything. Um, okay, that's weird. I wanted this for months. Alright, so let's get this thing open. Um, how do you open this? this uh, okay, here we go. So you open it from the bottom. And my nails are not helping. Okay, got it. So this is what we first see when we open the box. I'm so excited. Oh my god, it's so pretty. So obviously I got the colored one because I thought it was cooler. I mean, I am different. Let's see what we have. So this is the actual switch itself, like the, the screen. These are the two Joy-Cons that it comes with. Let's see what else is here. So this is the cable, the HDMI cable. This is the power card. And I'm pretty sure this is, yeah, this is like a, what is it called? A USB-C, which I love because now almost everything I have is USB-C, like my laptop, my phone, and now this, and I'm so happy. They're finally getting on the game. Alright, this is, the sets. Alright, this is um, the strap for the controllers, I believe. Cool. This is where you put the controllers when you're playing with it like this. On the TV, I guess. And this is the dog. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not. And wow, I was not expecting it to be this size. I don't know, when you watch all these videos, you really know until you finally get to see it. Oh my god, it's so pretty! Like, it's so basic. It's like really basic, but it's nice, you know? Like, it's minimalistic, which I like. So, yeah, you put the switch here when you want it to go on the TV, and here you can just opens up and you put all your cables through here. Like I'll show you guys. So let's actually open the thing up. Okay, so this is the device. And I'm so excited. Like I don't want this to drop or anything. Oh it doesn't have like a okay. Well it's just like this. And let's try putting on the, the controllers. It's so pretty, like the color, you don't get me. It's so bright and so pretty. Oh my god, I love it. I've only seen like um, the gray one in person really quickly. So I had some kid with it in the restaurant and I was like, I want it, please. Okay, so these are the little controllers. Basically what I understood is that you just slide them in here. Ooh. Okay, you slide this in and bam, here's your little device and it's actually a lot bigger than I thought it would be like look at it compared to my face it's pretty big but it's, it's big but it's like it's nice like I'm pretty sure I'll be able to like to play perfectly can't wait to get Zelda I didn't get any games because they only had like two games at the store I bought it I got a Toys R Us this is not a sponsored video by the way I bought it with my own money that's why I haven't gotten it until now I can't wait to turn it on and show you guys what it looks like. I'll go charge it in a bit and I'll come back. Wait, how do you take it off? Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, this is like, let me actually show you the thing. So here you can see we have the device. So this is the screen. It has the two Joy-Cons on the side, the controllers. Um, on the bottom, there's a charging port and that's it, yeah. On the top, there's a headphone port. So if you want to play on the go without disturbing people and there's also a speaker in the top and the back um here's where you put your game card so clearly i'm not going to be using that until i get a game i can't get this thing open okay guys um oh there we go all right so this is where you put your game card that's cool and then in the back there's a stand Oh my god, this is like a lot harder to open than it looks like on TV. On TV, on, on video, I don't know. How do I open this? I don't want to break it. Guys, how do you open this? Oh, it's, oh okay, there, there we go. I opened it. Oh, that's cool. It has like grip on the bottom. Alright, so this is a kickstand, but it's also where you can put your SD card if you get one. Which I highly encourage recommend. I highly recommend getting an SD card because there's not that much space in this and if you want to download your games and have them all on the go 
you're gonna need some space. If you just want to play with it like this, you just take this off, right? You press this button in the back, it's like the release button, and then you just slide it off. You can place your switch like that. I guess you just play with this, like, looking at it, like, like that, I don't know. And then there's also the controller, and I'm guessing you also you slide this in too. Oh god, <laughs> 10 hours later. Alright, and this is what it looks like. It's really cute, and it's really small actually. The controller, like I thought it was gonna be bigger, but it's it's nice. It's not. It's cool, definitely. If you're gonna take it on the go and traveling, I this is like mainly what I bought this for. It's like when I travel, I can't take any of my other games. I can't take my PlayStation traveling. So I got this so I can take it on the go and play anywhere. And I'm gonna go set it up, and I'll show you guys how I do that right now. All right, so I already connected everything, and I'll show you exactly how that is. So in the bottom we have a HDMI card, and then there's your adapter which is connected to the wall. And then you close this and turn it around, and I have my switch in there, which I just dropped it in. All right, so I just plugged in my switch, and now it's telling me to put on the controllers. So I'm just gonna put this on like this, slide it in like before. Sorry, the lighting is really bad, but there you go. Now it's on. And so now I think it's just gonna guide me through the setup and I'm just gonna do this and I'll come back when I'm done. All right, so now I'm ready to dock it. So I'm just gonna put it there and there it is. It's right on the TV. I'm gonna take the controller so I can click accept. Alright, so it's telling me to set my icon and nickname. So let's see what I should choose. I don't know. Alright, so what character should I choose? So this is what I chose as my icon. It's really girly, but I like it, so. Alright, now nickname. Mm, is this like a login or just your name? Okay. Cool. So it's telling you to link your Nintendo account. I think I have one, so I'm gonna try to do that. Okay, so my setup is complete. Awesome. And I don't have any games. <laughs> so, well, wow, let's let's check out stuff inside this. What else is there? Okay, so there's news. This is the news tab. Okay, what else? There's the eShop, your album, your controllers, system settings, and the sleep mode. Alright, thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like it if you enjoyed it. Comment down below if you want to see any other videos like this. And don't forget to subscribe. I'm gonna go have some fun with this. <laughs> Bye guys. Is it filming? Oh, it is. All right, hey guys, welcome back to my channel.